capture the imagination of the viewing public, and Hurricane Opal was no exception. This hurricane strengthened from a Category 2 to a strong Category 4 as people slept. A major concern for those working at the Weather Channel. Hurricane Opal caught a few folks off guard this morning, John, as we saw it absolutely explode overnight and turn into a very near Cat 5 hurricane. I've uh, seen a lot of hurricanes, Jim, and I never saw one strengthen as rapidly as this, but a Category 4 hurricane, the wind damage could be very, very great indeed. Pensacola Beach, which did get hit by Hurricane Aaron, probably will be dealt a much more severe blow. Quite a baptism for an on-camera meteorologist used to covering hurricanes from the studio, but not from the field. For years, I wanted to do live shots, but little did I know that I was getting into a Category 4, borderline Category 5 Hurricane Opal, and literally it was staring right at us and pointed right at us in Pensacola Beach. And once again, the rain has been tremendous. I have probably never witnessed so much rain in my life. Well, Bill, if you've never seen so much rain in your life, you're going to see a lot more in the next few hours, I'm sure. We had a lot of traffic there, people trying to evacuate. They were bumper to bumper. And that could have been one of the worst fears that we ever have, a Category 5 hurricane catching people out there on the highway where they couldn't move. And we have seen a pretty impressive hurricane here go up almost to Category 5. It's weakened, and that's great news this afternoon.